So now let's say you want to do a fraction. Now there's oftentimes many ways of doing a fraction. You know, you can possibly do the slash on your keyboard, but um, you don't have to. You can also, sometimes you just really want to have the number with the line going straight horizontal with the other number below it, the numerator over the denominator. So again, what you do is you pop open this view of the equation. Remember how you do that if you didn't already do it, which is you just go view, show equation toolbar. So let's say you wanted to write three fourths. You could just go like three. Oops. Here. We should put your cursor where it's supposed to be. Sometimes we make mistakes, you know, and that's great. But just keep going for it. Three fourths. You could do that. Or you go new equation. And then you look over here, right here, where it's math operations, this fourth one here. And you click where it's this fraction, A over B. So you click that. And let's say you want to write three fourths. So you write three. It's really small right now, but we'll fix that later. Four. Three over four. And so, and then let's say you wanted to make it like plus five. There we go. Now, if you notice three fourths is really small, so what you do is you select it. Select it, and then you go up here and you change the size. Let's say you want to change it to 14. There you go. Now it's bigger, so it's easier to see. It's pretty easy. Good luck.